What's happening my hoodlums and welcome back to Daybound And in today's episode, a very rainy episode To start with, yeah I can't control the weather So remember this portal we set up here for the two ancient cities just below us Well I did a thing More particularly, Salty and I did a thing So, I got together with Salty and we went to go raid those two ancient cities So I'm about to cut to those clips right about now here we are, far out, ready to raid uh, the portal. No, wait, ready to... Raid ancient cities. Raid Two. ancient city, yes. Woo. Woo. Woo, 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 woo. Woo. So hopefully we will come right with that. If not, well, uh, I guess we're going to leave our stuff here for the warden to keep for himself. We aren't losing any of our stuff. We'll be fine. We're professionals. I'm not sure if you watched my uh, warden episode, but oh, I think I've, I think I found it. Okay, it's down yep. here. So if we go to this aqua, uh, aqua aqua And here it is. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. It's right down here. Okay. Okay. Um. um oh, diamonds. GG. I would take them, but I got. Did you just drop it? <laughs> yes, I just dropped. Okay. Now we have to go in there to receive. <laughs> okay. Um, go up there instead of a bed place. I'm gonna go down and get that. Your diamonds. Okay. Start swapping my armor for other stuff mm. because I am not losing this armor. Oh yeah, you do not want to lose. Nether arts and... Yeah. Uh, so, I'm gonna... Place some water down here. Hopefully it doesn't flood anything. I have to stand on a gravel block when I place the water so it updates to... Ah, of course. Oh, of course. Like, it's never that easy. Alright, are we ready? Yes. Stealth mode activate. I can say for sure we've already got that one chest that's back there. Because I took all of its contents. Already? You work fast, Yes. Man. Well, the diamond fell right there, so... So it was, you know, just... While you added, just take me. Yeah. For audience enjoyment, I take night vision potion. That's a great Ooh. idea. Okay. Woo! <gasps> that helps you so much. I just fell. Okay. All right. I see two shriekers over there. Uh, I see some catalysts up there. I see a shrieker over there. Shriekers, hmm. shriekers. More Ooh. wool. You triggered a sh sensor, but it didn't. Yeah, sensors fine. Yeah, sensors are fine as long as they don't trigger a shrieker. So the walls are literally made out of wool? I don't know that. The walls are inlaid with wool. <gasps> oh my god! Get over here. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. Jump under the wall. Oh, these sensors are... Give me my nerves. I'm <laughs> They're freaking you out. Well, you really should freak out. But look what's in there. It's grey wool. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, I accidentally put. No, don't break it. Don't break it. Don't break it. No way. Double it? enchanted. You take Let's one. I'll take go. one. <laughs> you take one. I'll take yeah. one. <laughs> oh, no yeah. way. Oh. Oh. I think that was you. That's one for me. Dark. I think the average is like three. After three. It's you... four. It's four. Is you have it to. Four? Okay. It's a full health run. Okay, it's not ever going to be fully encased because there is a sensor right next to it. Yeah, and you can't break it. And there's a one at the bottom as well. So this is. Not yeah. A... Woo! Oh, that's two. That's my bad. I 
I forgot to bring blocks. I'm going to die. <laughs> <laughs> oh my man, this is not gonna go well. Please don't trigger anything. How this is... did you not bring blocks? <laughs> I don't know. This I... is like, like, I didn't bring blocks, but I brought shears to get as much wool as possible from here. Honestly, we should just go back up because up to that bridge. Oh, uh, God. You're fine. I'm oh. fine, it's my friend We're not Warden. Fine. Okay. It's my friend the Warden again. We're fine. Oh, he's after me. I don't know. Oh, he, he's really. He's yeah. after you? Yeah, he sonic boomed me. He must have heard me or sniffed me out. Ah! I've never been so terrified of those. I really don't understand the terror. It's like, yeah, it's a big monster, big honking monster I that think, can just eat through your armor. I think it's the sense it gives you, it's when you've gone through it, it's that basic instinct you know, like, oh, shoot, this thing's about to trigger another shrieker. And then you're like, oh, here comes trouble. Woo. Might come again. Um, over there. Uh, so I hope I'm gonna end the pull there. Let's see if I can. Oh. Okay, I'm here. Oh, I found some disc fragments, potion of regen, amethyst shard, a cat disc, an echo shard. Yeah, and that's it. Wait, did you get a cactus? Cat disc. Oh, oh, I thought you said cactus. Yeah, I don't I don't think they have a cactus. In there. I was going to say, because, like, why would there be a cactus? You don't know. Maybe they got funny loot in you. Salty, please don't log in now. Do not log in now. Ah, there he is. He's stuck. Although he's very near where Salty logged out. So hopefully, before he comes back, we don't just alert him. You still there? Uh, yeah, do not log in. I repeat, do not log in. Uh, so I got away from... Then I'm logging in. Okay. Uh, he's actually stuck. Oh, I see him. Do you see him? Have you got the darkness of- I see of... him. No, he's far enough away that I don't have the darkness of that. I'm not sure if he smells you. Yeah, he's near you. Oh, he's coming near you. He's coming. There's the intent. Oh, you flew away. Oh god. Okay. Yep, I flew away. Yeah, he- Oh. Oh, now we got two. <laughs> I just spawned another one. Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, there you are. There you are, buddy. It's fine, 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 I can live, I can survive anything. You're just running across the ancient city like it's nothing. What a champ. Oh my god, it's... there is so much in here. I triggered it. He's back again. He's right in It's fine. Don't eat, don't eat. Nah, he knows. He knows. Pearl away. Around the wall. Uh. I got everything. Yeah, he smells you. Okay. He's oh! Oh, where did he come from? He followed me! 
Oh, good job. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm running. <laughs> okay, I see you. Okay. That's one. Okay. And all your stuff is behind you. Screw this. <laughs> okay. Oh no, but the boop 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 boop. Goodbye, goodbye to that damn thing. I think you got it this time. Yeah. I have no care. Now we can run like crazy. Efficiency 5 and sharpness 5. Where's all the short sneaks? So I told you we got uh, another apple. Oh, you got another apple. Nice. Enchanted golden apple. Nice. Uh, chuck it away. What you got in there? I got oh diamond horse armor, potion of regen, two of them, and candles and a flame book. And that's it. Oh, I mustn't forget the skulls. Yeah, you're so much better at finding the skulls than I am. Okay, that's a third skull, I believe. Find uh, the next ones, or I don't know. You want to call it there? It um yeah i could call it a day yeah because it's getting pretty pretty late my side <laughs> oh hey look at your death count yeah oh nice we gotta put that on twitter <laughs> uh <laughs> i'm gonna put that on twitter we yeah. can come back to here later and get the rest of everything yeah hopefully soon and maybe with more That's people four enchanted apples and three uh skelly skulls I say that's yeah. successful. And the swift sneak, there's a few swift sneak books we actually got. It's not that bad. Yeah. Not level three, but still. So yeah, after a long night of just raiding these two ancient cities, Salty now came up with a lot of well loot. So much loot, in fact, quite a lot of epic loot, in fact. That I got it all here in this nice convenient little shulker right over here. We split the loot. And as you guys can see, I think our prize position out of this whole thing would have to be the in two golden enchanted apples. So, we found at least four enchanted golden apples within these two cities. Four! I mean, what? I mean, that's nuts. Even at the beginning, we off the bat, we found already two. I mean, two is just also absolutely nuts in one chest and yeah and i also found some skelly skulls at the end of it and unfortunately i only got one swift sneak two book and uh salty got the other ones so we weren't able to find what well i certainly was looking for and hopefully the others would be looking for but nonetheless it's still a swift sneak book also, we were able to find other side by Lena Rain. I've never actually found this disc before. I'm actually quite sure that uh, we found this and uh, awesome. Also, we just got the generic stuff, uh, Poison of Regen, which is Regen 2. So I didn't know you actually get Poison of Regen. And then Punch and all that stuff. Not much stuff here that is useful. But yeah. At the end of the day, uh, it was a lot of fun to do it. Even though it was a, a bit late at night for me. Extremely late at night. If you can sound, I was a bit tired at the end. <laughs> but it was fun. It was actually fun going around with Salty. Salty the brave man. <laughs> prancing along the ancient city like it's nothing. But uh, anyways, I guess people have different experiences with this. Some are scared. Like me. And Salty's just, well, he's a brave man. Oh! Right, so now we are in the nether. What are we doing on top of the nether? Well, recently in Discord, my servernates have been asking me something. Hey Hoodie, where's the bartering farm? You promised us a bartering farm and there's still no bartering farm. So apparently there is a big demand for gravel on the server at the moment. So now everyone's looking at me to give them that great supply of gravel. So swallow me, rabbit, and of course Marx is asking for gravel. But lucky enough for me, I have a bartering farm. Yes, by me. And this time I'm not taking from anyone else but myself. 
because this is an a hoodie hoodlands original design designed by me i'm 100 percent the creator of this farm perhaps you guys haven't seen it if you haven't seen it i'll leave a card up on the screen right now so you guys can check it out and of course i will leave a link in the descriptions for you guys to check it out after this video but anyways so the location for this farm will be directly above the gold farm there's the gold farm as it is uh it's a perfect location so we can just collect the gold from there uh bring it down here and then we can just barter with the uh the piglin we're not far away from the oh wait i haven't shown you guys this actually so this is becoming our nether hub at the moment so rabbit's making like a thunder dome and check this mansion out this was built by Marxcraft. when we started the series we threw out an idea of an upside down mansion and uh, yeah i think mark's really delivered on the mansion side so this head this portal heads back to the original mansion back in the overworld and uh yeah mark's mark's was previously a rich man previously a rich man uh at the moment this mansion is barren at the moment uh but i think this design looks cool and epic and as you can see on the corners here i believe rabbit is terraforming here i think he's making like like i said before a thunderdome not sure what that's all about but he wants to terraform this whole landscape i see he's always put an he's put an archway here but anyways enough showing that around so the bartering farm is just gonna go below the gold farm like i said before it would be easy just to transport all the gold here and just barter with the pigs so i'm thinking about placing it right over here so building this farm is i think it's going to be fairly quick it's not going to take that long to build it build it before i should know what i'm doing if i don't well it's, uh, i have a video on youtube so just watch my own tutorial or something <laughs> but anyways enough of me chatting about let me jump to the time lapse <laughs> One time lapse later as you guys can check we have built it so as you can see i got a swarmy in the background there he's about to shoot me so hopefully we can get 20 i think it's 24 piglins yeah but anyway so i got some of the bounties <laughs> together <laughs> and so i got swarmy uh, i believe magpie and salty will also be helping us and we're gonna try to get 26 piglins in that tiny shell and then the piglin farm should be done so they all been nice enchanted with uh cursor binding so i did that this so what you're saying is i shouldn't stand here and, and push the button no unless you wanna too late <laughs> <laughs> i'll Who be there to, to kill him in a moment <laughs> There's some netherrack for you, we can start building another platform. What it? Let's make in the... Well, we need so much to put on all these boots. So... And until we run out of boots, yeah. we bring piglets. Yeah. Ah, uh, there's one. We got some... Yeah. I'll Endermen. Go, yep, go down, go down, go down. Make sure he doesn't despawn. Two Endermen. Oh, there he is. And there's a child. The child won't grow up, so avoid the child. Well, we can't keep the child. Actually, it's better to kill the child. Yeah, I was just going to kill him. Now I've got the adult <laughs> mad at me. Trap door. Open the trap door. He should fall in. Oh. There you go. Boom. Done. Got First one. one. <laughs> oh. So, must I just stand here and just keep the piggies? Keep the farm running, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm just flying around in free cam. Reviting content. Yeah. Oh, near the bricks. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, Ooh piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. candy. Hey, that used to be my gamer tag. Piece of candy. <laughs> That's right, it did. There we go. He's got his leather boots on. <clears throat> so we put cursor. 
we put curse of binding on them because they can swap it with iron boots as well yeah they'll oh, that's swap true, yeah. for upper level yeah so you can put normal leather boots but they'll just swap it and it's quite annoying it's like can you just keep your leather boots on? <laughs> that's why you gotta bind it to them so they don't swip swap them oh we got a regular big one. Oh, we got two nice just a lot of zombie piglins i'll start killing the zombies if you want to throw gold lure them piglins are so easy to move when they fixated on a piece of gold mm -hmm. it's better than villagers <laughs> yeah i really wish we could do the same thing with emeralds imagine if we had to put in brutes to get the ultimate bartering farm yeah <laughs> That would not be cool. <laughs> Get your booties, your free pair. There you go. There we go. Now you need to go. Go in here. Go in here. Oh, uh, this Get guy. Out. There we go. Yay! Everybody. Hey, look at that guy. He's not wearing bling bling. <laughs> it's dang fashion police. <laughs> I just realized we made stairs for them to go down. <laughs> <laughs> We can just spot on the off, platform maybe. and be like, ooh. Oh, let's go walk on the roof. <laughs> yeah. Okay, go Get through in. the metal detector. Thank you, sir. Oops, <laughs> I just put a torch. <laughs> it's okay, the torch will Light be sorted. Light the way. Oh, no, he's, he's on the bottom. Oh, my oh, God. No. <laughs> Salty, you exploded I... everywhere. <laughs> he's not, he's not no. Please tell me there's I was like, what there. the heck just fell? It was Salty. Uh, there is a child picking up your stuff. <laughs> there is gonna be a lot of gold because I yes, have like the child two stacks is, of gold. The child is picking up the gold. <gasps> oh my god! Uh, huh? An <laughs> what the heck? What the heck? An endermine? How the heck? Oh, the greatest shit. death of them all. An endermine. <laughs> I'm glad I'm getting all this on camera. I'm trying to get it. keep it going. I just I hate that it takes forever for them to assess the gold. Like, what do I want to drop? What's my well, most junkiest mm -hmm. item I can drop? They they gotta bite the gold to make sure it's real first, and then <laughs> is it soft <laughs> enough to be gold? Listen, magpies yeah. don't deal with the the fake gold. Do the real gold? Yes. There we go. <laughs> We got you. Oh my oh god. god. He's just... <laughs> this is why I throw gold. Pick it, pick... In. Yep. In. Oh you my god. I love my life today. <laughs> yeah, both both of these guys over here I killed had booties on already. Yeah. <clears throat> Golden boots. Yeah, they were no go. Oh no. You gotta. You gotta chase him. Oh, there's another one. I. That was the one with leather. Oh, oh dang. <laughs> but he's like, that's it. You're fired. You're fired. You're fired. Get out of here. <laughs> Open the trap door. I think we both opened it at the same time. Yeah. Nice. Let's just give him a nudge and boom. Get in the hole. That's your home. Don't you want to go to your home? Yeah. There we go. Good job. Good job. You're almost there. Nice. You've been promoted. To botterer. <laughs> Nobody will see this. Okay. <gasps> I saw it. <laughs> you weren't supposed to see it. <laughs> ah, no. He picked it up from me. Ah, you got it. He's on. Yep. It's going to be the last guy. Come on. Come on, bacon feet, come on! Bacon feet. <laughs> He's in! Yay, okay. Yeah. And after a few minutes of trying to collect 24 piglins, we got 24 piglins. So I want to thank Swarmy, Salty, and Magpie for helping me collecting 24 piglins in that chamber over there. And as you guys can see, I've been doing a little bit of work here and there. Uh, so currently the farm is active and working. Well, it's not active now. So in order to start the farm, you're going to fill all these droppers up full of gold. And then of course, the last dropper, as soon as a piece of gold is placed in here, the farm will be working. 
and then it will be distributing all the gold to the piglins and then they will toss all the goods that they want to barter with us and it will all get sorted over here and at the bottom we got the chest storage so currently i have decided one thing that i wanted to do with this chest storage so i made this chest storage into a well self-service since people needed gravel or blackstone or whatever they wanted they can simply just come here look at the prices and deposit diamonds in here and take whatever items they want so of course gravel and blackstone have already got prices some prices are free like this iron nuggets we've got nether brick all the stuff so all the items that we get from this farm is all getting sorted they all have a price uh in the pools are for free and then at the end is the overflow chest which some of these items are oh, oh uh <laughs> piglum swept yeah uh <laughs> That's just an inside joke there. Everything at the end except for the book. So soul speed will cost two diamonds for a book. Uh, so yeah, I priced everything and we should be getting diamonds. Maybe soon. More than not, we might be getting diamonds for gravel. Because I know gravel is a hot commodity because I believe people are starting to build with concrete. So um, yeah, gravel to make concrete. I just don't have sand. Although maybe I should try open a sand shop. Who knows, who knows. But as you guys can see, this is all done. It's all completed. Uh, the bounders can come here. They can buy whatever they want. And uh, happy buying, I guess, bounders. So guess what, guys? That's all that I got for today. So if you guys would kindly leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell, the notifications. Let me know in the comments what you thought of this video. I know it's been a long time since I released a video. Uh, life has been a bit hectic lately. But uh, hopefully we can try to get back on track. Hopefully, who knows, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. But anyways, I'm going to ask you guys to leave a like, subscribe, all that stuff. And uh, I'll check you in the next episode. So, for now, goodbye.